Hi there folks, today we're talking about tracking numbers and Google My Business. Now historically, you haven't been able to use a lot of tracking numbers in digital marketing, particularly on the organic and SEO side, because of the way that search engines deal with NAP and, uh, and NAP consistency. Now what NAP is, is name, address and telephone and making sure that wherever you list your business information those pieces of information all match that's very important for SEO particularly on the local SEO side and so now Google has changed a few things where you can add tracking numbers to your Google my business without messing up your nap consistency and so let's get into it and see how we do that Okay, so if you want to add a tracking number, you're going to want to head over to the left menu and click on info. And you scroll down a little ways, you'll see a section for phone numbers. You click on the pencil and there's a primary phone spot and an additional phone spot. Now this is very important. You want to put your tracking number in the primary phone slot. The reason is because when somebody interacts with your Google My Business profile, let's say they click on the call button in the map section or on your profile, that's going to connect to that phone number. And if you want to track your calls from your Google My Business, that's where your phone needs to be. The additional phone number is for your regular phone number, your landline, uh, any other phone numbers associated with your business. And this is great because this tells Google, hey, this phone number is associated with my business and it doesn't mess up that nap consistency, which is so important. Okay, so if you want a tracking number and you don't currently have one, of course there are lots of companies you can go with, uh, but one option you have is actually included in your Google My Business profile, uh, at least there's advertisement for it in your Google My Business profile, and that's called CallJoy. And one of the reasons I like CallJoy is that it has unlimited minutes. It's $39 a month, which is a little bit higher per month than some other options out there, uh, but for some businesses it'll actually be cheaper uh, because many of the options out there will charge you per minute and uh, again for many businesses this can add up. Another option is Grasshopper that is $29 a month for one phone number and again it's unlimited minutes they did used to charge by minute but recently changed that and uh, so these can both be great options for call tracking numbers I'm sure you all can Google and, and figure out what's best for you but hopefully this helps you learn how you can track your phone numbers and your uh, phone activity from Google my business if you have any questions please put them in the comments below I'll see you on the next video